Hi friends, we at Applied Course are extremely happy to announce a new course called the Interview Preparation Course, which helps students and working professionals to prepare for software engineer roles at various companies. Right. So before I can, you can find everything about this course at interviewprep.appliedcourse.com. Let me give you a brief overview of what this course says and why we designed it and things like that. So first and foremost, why did we design this course, right? We already have very successful AI course and also a gate computer science course. And based on the feedback and requests that we've seen from hundreds of students who are attending either interviews as part of their college placement or as part of the transition from one company to other company, we have gotten tons of requests from students that it will be great if we could if we could create an interview preparation course based on based on our own experiences as interviewers at lots of companies. So the focus of this course itself will be on C programming, data structures, algorithms, SQL, some basic concepts in operating systems and aptitude, because these are the typical concepts that are given most focus in any type of software engineer like interviews. Again, some of these concepts are also important, not just for software engineer, not just for software development engineer roles, but also for other related roles. For example, if you're interviewing for a data scientist or a machine learning role, especially at top notch product based companies, you might have one or two rounds covering programming data structures and algorithms, right? So the whole objective of this course is to build foundational computer science knowledge amongst our students and also teach them how to solve re how to solve real problems, right? Because most companies are looking for these two skills. They're looking for foundational knowledge of computer science and strong problem solving skills, right? And again, the focus mostly is on C data structures, algorithms, SQL, some basic concepts in operating systems and aptitude. And that's what we will limit ourselves to as part of this course, right? So you might wonder where, where are these skills useful? Because I've, I've been talking about two types of skills. One is a foundational knowledge in computer science. The second is the problem solving skills. You might wonder where are these skills useful? Let's look at two broad categorizations of companies, as many of, many of you may already know. There are product based companies and there are services companies. So typical product based companies, companies like Amazon, Google, Microsoft, Flipkart, Facebook, etc. Almost every interview that you encounter, right, and every coding test you might participate before being called to an interview, they focus on problem solving skills that revolve around data structures and algorithms mostly. You might have a few aptitude questions also in some cases. You might have a few SQL questions also, but mostly they will revolve around programming data structures and algorithms, right? Similarly, even at services companies and a ton of startups nowadays, like TCS, Infosys, Cognizant, Wipro, Swiggy, etc., right? Many of these companies are also offering better and well-paid and also great work developer roles using coding competitions like Code Vita and Hack with Infi. Right? TCS conducts something called Code Vita and Infosys conducts something called Hack with Infi. And they tend to provide good high quality developer roles to, to employees or to students who crack these coding into these coding rounds. Right? So the skills that I've been talking about like foundational skills and problem solving skills are important both for product based companies and also more and more important for services based companies. Similarly, if you want to participate in any competitive programming competitions, right? Like you might, you might want to participate in competitions on Hacker Rank, Hacker Earth, Interview Bit, and there are many such platforms, right? Most of these competitive programming platforms test your skills in one, any programming language. So we are right now focusing only on C programming language because most students are aware of C programming language. So they would focus on programming, knowledge of a programming language, data structures, algorithms, SQL, maybe a bit of operating systems and aptitude, right? So that's why, so all these skills of both foundational knowledge and problem solving skills are useful for product based companies, services based companies, and also for competitive programming. Having said that, how did we design this course? Again, the team that has designed this course and the mentors that we have, have extensive experience they have done hundreds of interviews at some of the top notch companies like Amazon, Facebook, Microsoft, etc. So based on our own experiences as interviewers and hiring managers, we have designed this course, right? 
This course consists of 150 plus hours of video content and there are no prerequisites to understand the content. So we, we start every concept from the very basic foundations from scratch, right? And as I mentioned, the contents of the course itself will be limited to C, data structures, algorithms, problem solving, SQL, basics of operating systems and aptitude as these are the topics that are often covered in interviews for software engineer roles, right? We will also focus on some real world applications when we learn concepts. We don't want you to learn concepts from a very theoretical dry viewpoint. We want you to be able to appreciate the real world applications of these concepts. And for every, for see the important skill is just knowing the concepts is not sufficient. Being able to solve problems is very important. So we have a wide spectrum of problems, both solved problems and practice problems that we will mark as basic, easy, medium, hard and very hard. Typically, typically, again, this is not a hard and fast rule, but typically services companies tend to focus their questions on basic, easy and a few medium questions, while top product based companies tend to focus most of the problems they give on medium, hard and very hard problems. So we will cover the whole spectrum of problems so that you are prepared both for product based companies and services based companies, whichever you think is apt for you. Having said that, we also have a ton of quizzes to help you clear return tests. Many of these companies also conduct return tests to filter out a bunch of students whom they would take for the next rounds. So to help you clear these return tests, we have a bunch of quizzes as part of the course. Having said that, who is the target audience? Who, who, can, who can actually do this, do this course? Who will benefit from this course? If you're a BTEC or a BE student or a BS student, in any discipline of engineering or sciences, this will help you. Similarly, if you're an MTech student or a Master of Engineering student or an MS student in, in, in US or in Europe, this, certainly, this course will certainly help you land into software engineering roles or roles which require the skills in data structures and algorithms. Similarly, if you're, if you're an engineer who is working at a services company and want to upskill yourself and move to a product-based company or a, or a startup, some of the skills that you learn in this course are critical. Similarly, if you're a student who is studying Bachelor of Computer Applications or MCA or MSc Computer Science, this course certainly will be useful. Similarly, if you are a student pursuing any course or any degree, if your coursework and curriculum contains C programming language, data structures and algorithms, you will surely benefit from this course. Okay. So any student who falls in any one of these categories or more one or more of these categories would certainly benefit from this course. Having said that, what services do we offer as part of this course? The course validity itself is one year and during this one year, any question, any question that you have as far as not understanding a concept or not understanding a problem under every video. The, so the way we have organized this is under every video that we have, we have a detailed comment section, right? So you can place your comments there and one of our teammates and one of our mentors will clarify your doubt in under 24 hours. So just to give you a context around it, for Applied AI course, which is another very popular course that we run, we answer thousands of such comments and emails every month. Okay, so we have been doing it for over a year and a half and we've become very good at it, right? So most of the questions will be answered in under 24 hours. So comments under the videos is a great way to post your questions, which others also can see. And you can also read others questions to be able to better understand the concept itself better. Similarly, you can shoot an email to us and we'll respond back as soon as possible. And most likely in under 24 hours with any question you have, we also provide audio and video answers. Suppose the question that you asked is very good. Okay. It is better to, instead of writing a text answer, if it is better to write an audio or video answer to explain that, to explain the answer to the question. We tend to prefer that and we have become fairly good at providing audio video answers based on our AI course. Similarly, if, if none of these are helping you resolve your questions, we sometimes uh, also call you up on phone or Skype to resolve your questions. The very important thing is when we resolve questions, we don't want to give solutions directly because giving the solution is the easy part for us. But if I just give you solutions, you will not build upon the problem solving skills, which are critical by just reading a solution, you don't build the problem solving skills. The problem solving skills are, are always built by practice, right? By taking hints, even in the real world interviews, an interviewer does not give you the direct solution. If you cannot answer, 
he or she will provide a hint first. So in the similar fashion, whenever there is a query that you have, we will first provide hints so that you are building up your problem solving skills and not just looking up a solution directly. Similarly, every month we will conduct assessment tests to mimic the real world of interviews and to, 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 to teach you about how real world problem solving at a wide spectrum of companies actually works out. Right? So these assessment tests are conducted every month. Similarly, for students, we will give you a personalized schedule to keep yourself on track. Okay? Because the course itself is 150 hours of course. So we will give you a personalized schedule on what topics you need to cover on daily basis to be able to complete the course and to make the most out of this course itself. So as part of this course, we also provide job assistance to all of our registered students. And the eligibility criteria for job assistance is to, is to secure at least 50 plus marks in any one of the assessment tests without cheating. Okay. So the assessment tests that we conduct monthly in the one year of your course duration, you can attempt 12 such tests. And each of these tests will cover a wide spectrum of topics. So it is best if you first finish the course, finish the practice problems and start taking these tests. Right? Once you start taking these tests, in any one test, if you secure more than 50% marks, you are eligible for a job assistance program. So as part of the job assistance program itself, we will conduct three mock interviews by actual interviewers at various companies, which will give you a very good feedback, also which will give you a very good idea on how real world mock real world interviews at various companies actually happen right so as soon as soon as you're eligible for the job guarantee we'll start scheduling three mock interviews and we'll give you extensive feedback on areas that you need to improve on we'll also help you build a strong resume and we we'll refer you to various roles like software engineering roles and assist you for 6 months by referring you to various teams and recruiting partners that we work with. Okay. Having said that, the most important thing for you is if you're interested in this course, please check out a bunch of sample videos that we've put at interviewprep.appliedcourse.com. This is our website. Please check out this website and you'll find a bunch of sample videos so that you understand the quality of the videos, the quality of the content and how we have taught each of these concepts. And any questions that you have, please shoot an email to interviewprep at appliedcourse.com and we'll respond to respond back to you as soon as possible. If you prefer calling us and finding more about this course, please call us at plus 918448440102. We will try and answer as many calls as possible. In case we miss a call or if the phone is busy, we'll revert back to you as soon as possible.